Here we are in the chapel of St. James Church. This is the Daily Mass Chapel, and here we have Mass Monday through Friday, uh, and also smaller weddings and funerals. Uh, in this chapel is uh, an icon, uh, a fabric icon of the Stations of the Cross according to John Paul II. St. John Paul II, or St. John Paul the Great, uh, developed a series of Stations of the Cross based on the scriptures, which are a little bit different from the traditional Stations of the Cross. These uh, scriptural Stations of the Cross are depicted here in a stylized form on this uh, icon. You see here at the beginning, Jesus' agony in the garden. Okay. He's kneeling, asking God to take away the cup from him. Of course, God does not do that. Jesus then proceeds to go on to follow his path towards crucifixion. The next icon here shows Judas kissing Jesus, the kiss of betrayal. We have here Jesus standing in front of Pilate, who is judging him and condemning him to death. We then have uh, Jesus here, uh, or I should say Peter, denying Jesus three times, and this cock or rooster is crowing three times, you know, reminding you know, Peter that, he, that Jesus predicted that he would condemn him or deny him three times before the cock crowed. Here we have Pilate washing his hands after he condemns Jesus and says basically to the people of God that the blood of uh, Jesus is on your hands. You know? Here we have Jesus being scourged. You see he's been crowned with thorns, he's being whipped by a soldier. Here Jesus is made to carry the cross. Okay. Um, here we have uh, Jesus carrying the cross and uh, being helped by Simon of Cyrene. This one, Jesus is carrying the cross and is met by his mother and the women of Jerusalem. Here we have Jesus being uh, nailed to the cross, okay? uh, and then we have Jesus being, uh, you know, continued to be, you know, nailed to the cross, He's saying to the, to the beloved disciple, uh, behold uh, your mother, and so forth. So here we have these whole montage here to fix that side scene, the scene of the cross where Jesus is speaking to people. And here we see Jesus' mother Mary and John the, Bap or John the Apostle, the beloved disciple, uh, near him. And here we have Jesus dying on the cross. And then finally, Jesus being laid in the tomb. So these are a little bit more uh, stylized version of, of the uh, crucifixion and the last days of Jesus. This is a very nice uh, print uh, that uh, used to hang in the Archbishop's Chapel here in Detroit, and when there was a renovation was being done, uh, it was given to us, and we keep it here as a reminder of uh, the Stations of the Cross according to John Paul II, uh, scriptural Stations of the Cross. So if you're visiting St. James and you wish to do a Station of the Cross, you may either use the traditional ones, which are in the main part of the church, or the uh, ones of John Paul II here in the Daily Mass Chapel.